Made it. Hear that announcement? That's my flight boarding. I got to the airport like five minutes ago. You know, for as much as I travel, it's amazing that I actually get anywhere, because I'm always late. So I'm filming on my phone instead of my vlogging camera, but uh, it's February the 10th on a Saturday, and this is gonna be a short vlog, because this is a short trip. 24 hours back and forth from Phoenix, all by myself, for the premiere of A Silent Voice. Let's go. was such an easy flight. I'm always flying to uh, the East Coast internationally, but an hour, just one hour? Oh my God, I'll take it. Let's go get my ride. Dual standing escalators. My friend uh, just said he was on the curb. So is it door number one? Or door number two? No, no, I was told this was supposed to be a sedan. Uh, just supposed to be a sedan, town car or nothing. I gotta go. I'm going back home. It's a busted ass CRV. I'm so sorry. So we made it to Matt's place. I changed. He's uh, showering up. His place is so cool. It was built in the 30s. It's like a New York style apartment. Uh, I'm gonna rummage through his shit. He just moved in, so he's got all this great art just waiting to be hung up. Nothing to see here. Yeah, like, just a totally normal place. Tengu! Shrines. More shrines. I love this place. He's so much cooler than me. Oh my hey, hey Matt, you got a lot of great stuff in here, but uh, I have a few questions. <laughs> Okay, so clearly these are a gag from who? From your... These are a gag from my sister-in-law. Okay, and what other gag did she leave for you when you moved? She in? left me this... She found a pair of underwear that she was like, this, this certainly has to be yours, right? <laughs> and I was like, looks like me. <laughs> like... Balcony. Oh yeah, there's an upstairs balcony. Even your alley is cool, you asshole. Yeah, it's not bad. That's baseballs. Why is the entire cast? Is there a convention? Hey, is there a convention going on? Oh shit, that's today. Yeah, you look awesome. Oh, fuck, you guys are amazing. Let's go. Where's it at? Where are we going? Everywhere. It's everywhere. Great. Right. Okay, perfect. That's right up the street from where we're going, actually. <laughs> Wherever we go. The nerds will follow. Fucking space balls! Carts. You so, design a shopping cart and then oh, you race it. Oh, look at all these people! Dressed up in their, their like little crews. So it's like a soapbox race. It is. It's uh, But you but, have to dress like an idiot. But you gotta dress like an idiot. And it's called the Idiot Rod. Yeah, and it's based off of because they do that kind of thing with... Up in Alaska or something like that. It's, it's a very similar name. The Iditarod. The Iditarod, right? But yeah. here it's the Idiot Rod. <laughs> Great, because there's no snow here. <laughs> And this is our destination. Well, Good luck in the race! Do it! Yeah! As soon as we get here... <laughs> Hi! Hi. It's our Tiny Conference! Oh. I know you, but introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Joyce. I am the Marketing Director for TileCon. I have uh, 100 emails from you and yes. my email. <laughs> Hi, my name is Michael. I'm the Convention Director for TileCon and I'm a uh, super anime. <laughs> Hi, I'm Gokdo and I'm the chairman for TayoCon. This feels like uh, the world's worst dating video. <laughs> where you're like all trying to... Oh, and who are, who are you? Hi, I'm Dr. Sandoval. I'm a douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mama's here. Her daughter. And the award for first done goes to... Nope! Who was you? <laughs> <laughs> 
guys have only had two bites. You're on a mission. Look at all that chicken. Bye bye. Bye bye. Say goodbye. That's I tell you again. I have to hang out with these two, though. Don't leave. You were hanging out. Uh, we do. Uh, we do have a little announcement to make, though. Oh, this lighting. <laughs> Uh, as soon as we all sign our contracts, we're letting you know that next year, 2019, who's gonna be at Tayo? Robbie, um, Max Middleman, and Ray Chase. Lava's coming to Arizona, baby! Yeah! Yeah! On to the movie. See you later, guys. Bye bye. bye. <laughs> A terrible at intros. What, what are we doing? We're here at Film Bar. We are here at Film Bar tonight. This is Saturday night, February 10th. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Well, I said that. Or they know what day it they is. They know what day it is. We don't know what day it but is. But this is your inaugural showing. Exactly. So I was asked by Film Bar a while ago to um, think through ideas of programming, of how I might be able to bridge the divide between the film community, local film community here in Phoenix, and Arizona State University, which is where I teach. I'm a professor there. Dr. Uh, Sandoval. Dr. Uh, Sandoval. You might remember him from the uh, the infamous San Diego Comic Con, where do they shit question? Hey, where, how do they shit? Seriously, those of you who have seen people in cosplay, you know. <laughs> no, wait, 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 wait hold up. on a second. <laughs> Sorry. That's an old blog. That's, that's ah, a, it's, yes. It's Let's bring mystery, us up to the contemporary It's a mystery moment. that's got to be answered. <laughs> so Matt told me about this back last year. And, yes. And I was like, well, that sounds awesome. Can I come and do a talk back? Absolutely. Yeah. So it started as that. Um, you know, part of it is just I have so many people who are in my life that I love who are doing fantastic work. This is, yes, this is one of those people who just is doing fantastic work right now. Work which needs to be shown, work, work which needs to be uh, enjoyed by an audience and kind of be able to be talked about. So I was like, do you want to come with this show, A Silent Voice, which is playing tonight? And I must say, it got a fantastic response already. It sold out in two days, which is quite rare in Phoenix, especially for Film Bar. Like, it's it's doing really and well. And anime. We've been and trying to tell them, like, anime's got an audience. It does. So, it really so does. So they reached out to Eleven Arts, who agreed to do this. There was a showing last weekend across the country. Mm -hmm. They agreed to do this kind of later showing. And I'm going to do a talk back afterwards and, uh, and talk to these kids. And you guys are sold out for Rocky Horror Picture Show yes. right after this. So it's a fantastic night of cinema, but yes. So yeah. special to have anime here, the show here, Robbie. Here. And if if you guys are in Phoenix, I know a lot of you that watch are, mm -hmm. uh, hit up Film Bar and ask and see what you want to see. Absolutely. Like, hit, hit up Matt and he's going to be curating some more films, some non-anime yes. anime yes. films here. And, uh, and bring or anime to your community. Or perhaps more anime. Yeah. Or perhaps more anime. So please. I'll yes. look you up with some people a lot cooler than me to come see it. Oh God, there's got to be people cooler oh, no. than you. Are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this the quote I need? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a classic. Oh, yeah. What skin you shall receive? Shut up, baby. That looks like more than the shop, man. What do you got going? Can I see what you got? There you go. Oh, my God. You got the turkey chicken with fries. That's $10 right there, baby. It's $10. And we're in downtown Phoenix. What was your name again? My name is Chef Lowe. Oh, God. And we're. Come on down. We have the film bar. We're yep. at the film bar, we're doing it up, man. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. We got jerk chicken, mm. we got barbecue ribs, pulled pork, and it's all $10. Come down, check out Chef Lowe. This is the best commercial I ever filmed. <laughs> <laughs> we're here early, and this place is awesome. <laughs> Come on. Okay, Noah. Uh huh. Danielle. And behind the pillow. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Are you excited to see the movie tonight? Yes. yes. Yay. I am. Thank you for coming. Yeah. You know we're sold out tonight, right? Really? Yeah. Uh, Three days. You got it. Let me see your tickets. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't think these are real. These girls. <laughs> Movies with mommy. Papa, I'm waiting for Robbie's, the credits to come up with Robbie's name on it so I can get a picture of his and his dad. Well, I won't bug you then. <laughs> you know what I love about a movie? I love it when people are drinking. Now you won't really That's my favorite. Part of me looks like This movie's gonna be great. Let's do it. All right, Matt's about to come out and announce us. He is excited to watch some amazing anime tonight. Woo! 
Hold on. <laughs> Let me ask this question again. <laughs> How many people are ready to watch some amazing anime film tonight? Woo! <laughs> okay, okay, that's more like it. Thank you so much. My name is Dr. Matthew Sandoval. I'm a professor uh, at Arizona State University at the downtown Phoenix campus. Um, I've been working with Film Bar for a little bit. First of all, raise your hand if this is your first time at Film Bar. Whoa, so we got a lot of new folks. Welcome to Film Bar. Can I just say that? Welcome to Film Bar. Uh, Phoenix's premier and only, really, art house, independent art house cinema. Uh, so I've been working with Film Bar for a couple of months, uh, thinking through some programming options, things that I might want to bring in. I must say that part of the appeal for me is I have so many people in my life who I love deeply, who are doing beautiful, creative, inspiring work. One of those works is the film that we're about to watch, A Silent Voice. One of those people is none other than Robbie Damon, who is oh, in the back here. <laughs> I love deeply, brother from another mother, even though his mother is sitting right next to him. Yeah, hey! Uh, <laughs> um, so we are going to do a screening of this film. Robbie is going to join us after the screening in order to do uh, a Q&A session, so please stick around. You know, I'm sure you'll have a number of things that you might want to ask of this film. This is a really beautiful film, really moving and powerful film. So really buckle in and let's enjoy the hell out of this thing and kind of figure out what this community might look like since we are all gathered here for the sacred act of like just enjoying each other's company and enjoying a work of art at the same time. Cool, all right, Randy, let's roll. Let's do this. <laughs> What did you say? I can't even believe. I can't believe what you put me through. What did you say? Over the years. You said I played so many characters who died. Yeah. Died. Well, uh, starting in. <laughs> is there something you're trying to tell us? So in. I died. You have died. Oh no. <laughs> Pancake boy. No, I still have your signature on it. Oh no. <laughs> Mom's mad. Mom's mad because I die in everything. <laughs> Junior high, every part you had, I had to go and cry because you died. Sorry, mommy. So I thought he did it again tonight. <laughs> you guys were on the um. Oh, on the after the after party patio. And oh hi, it's you again. You again. <laughs> and we're hanging out with uh, our friend Evan. <laughs> he won the the free the, ticket. Yes, we were sold, sold out, and I got to come, and I'm so happy. So we're gonna. I'm gonna rub you for good luck. Yeah. This is my mom. Hi, mom. I'm nervous about the glasses. <laughs> it makes me suspicious. And our only two cosplayers tonight. Oh my goodness. I said he just looks like he could maybe... Wait, wait, hold on. Wait. Oh, no! <laughs> I don't have my bread. You know, why don't you have your bread? You ate it. I went in the theater, and then I left it, and then I'm like, oh, no, my bread. I'm like, no, I have my bread. What are your What are your actual names? Uh, I'm Corey. Corey? This is, this is Nikki. Good, and what? Nikki. Did you have a good time? Yeah. Wait. Dubs v subs for Silent Voice. Dubs oh, on. Oh, she hesitated, but she went for it. <laughs> hi, Summer. Hey, how's it going? This is this is what happens. You can't come over and say hi without your face in the just really oh, awkward, oh. uncomfortable oh, close-ups. So just. Is that what is that what Max does? Yeah, that's what that's what Ray does. He knows how to drop in. No wait, but if I was Max, it'd be like this. <laughs> <laughs> I sorry Matt. I sorry Matt. I was my, just kidding. My mom just made a short joke to Max. <laughs> Perfect. Mama, what did you think of the movie? Oh, it was. Be honest. No, it was beautiful and heartwarming, and I cried, and I'm glad you didn't die. Did you cry a little bit? A little bit. bit. Like I had a little tear. Just one little tear. <laughs> a little tear. Not as many as you. I looked over and saw you. I you know, it's true. I I got a little bit. Uh, I got a little bit misty. Well. <sighs> It was a beautiful story. Yeah, and a beautiful film. Really well animated. 
You I know what? I'm saying it right now on the vlog. <laughs> Fuck Boss Baby. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking boss, baby. That shit deserved about as much Oscar as the last shit I took. <laughs> boss, baby. Silent voice needed that Oscar. Everybody in the audience thought so, too. It's true. In yeah. the, the Q&A, everybody said. Well, who knows? Got it. Who knows? Who knows what the Academy thinks? <laughs> I take all this back if I ever get nominated. <laughs> uh... Well, this is how the night ends. I'm going back to my fancy schmancy hotel. Who got 22nd you? 22nd floor. Who got you that schmancy you schmancy did. hotel? You yeah, did. oh, that's good. Yeah. That's good. I'm going to get a massage in the morning and <laughs> room service. Really? Uh huh. Oh, what a bunch and of bullshit. And then putting bullshit. it on your tab. What a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> I'm sleeping on Matt's couch. <laughs> I see how it is. Yeah, well, I deserve it. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's true. I wouldn't be here without you. That's right. Literally. Literally. Uh, well, Mom, I've been in a lot of movie premieres, and this is the first one you've ever seen. You've been to, you've lived, no, no, not, not because, not because you, not because you, I have like, been to everything you've ever done. Right, my very first play, she's been to, you know, 50 plays. 50? 50? Least. That was like before you were 15. <laughs> and, uh, but this is the first movie you got to see me in, and I'm glad we could make it happen. And it was a beautiful movie, indeed. All right, Mama, I'm gonna go have uh, a bite and a drink and uh, with, uh, with Matt and his date. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow, She's Mama. Ready to. Night! What's How happening here? How did this happen? How did you end up here? We thought we were rid of you. I was in my car and I was like, oh, if you're walking your mom, I'll just swing by. Did you get arrested again? <laughs> She's been she's been such a, a mother of me all night. Just a total asshole. I love it. I love it. Uh, are you picking us up? Yeah, I was gonna say if you want to go, unless you're gonna hang with your mom, and then I'll, I'll tell you where to go. You just turned into Woody Allen for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go. You bet. You bet. Bye, mama. <laughs> No, I'm shooting me roll. <laughs> <laughs> shooting me roll. We're leaving Phoenix. Say goodbye, everyone. Bye, Bye. everyone. I can't. What? That was. What? That was. That was. That's that was he legitimate. Said, he said, he said exactly bye. What he said to do. Bye. 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 Well, I'll end this vlog like I started it in the airport. 24 hours, and it was a great 24 hours. You know, for all the, the cool stuff I get to do, and the, the great job that I have, and how grateful I am for all of that, the best part of it is fans, friends, and family. I love you guys. I gotta be real. We're done with the evening. I'm a little concerned about your neighbors. What the fuck? Hey man, it's a holiday wreath. <laughs> I, I gotta sleep like 10 feet away from that shit? Mommy, you are sleeping in my bed. I'm not sleeping in your bed. You're, sing no, you're, no, no, you're no, no, single. No, no, no. You're single. You have sex in that bed. I'm not sleeping in your Hold sex on. bed. I'm Hold not that. sleeping in there. I'm not doing it. Okay. <laughs> Two things yeah. to know. Three things to know. You can't one, deal with my I, furious vlog. Hold on, three things to know. Yeah. One is that I'm Mexican, and this is Mexican house rules. Is that the guest always thinks you that. That's just true. That's a truism among Latinos. Okay. Thing number two to know is ain't nobody fucked in that bed because I haven't fucked in that bed in over a year. Fair enough. Thing three, I wash the sheets for you, homie. <laughs>